Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. I hope you all are fine and safe at your home. Welcome you all in maths class. We are doing chapter 5 angles from book 4 A. Okay. Uh, you know about angles. What are angles? We have done already. But uh, this definition is, I repeat again for you. Uh, when two straight lines meet at a point, an angle is formed. ठीक है आपके पास जैसे टू स्ट्रेट लाइंस हो एक स्ट्रेट लाइन आपके पास ए बी है और एक स्ट्रेट लाइन आपके पास बी सी है अगर मैं इन दोनों लाइंस को एंड पॉइंट से जोड़ दूं तो इट मींस कि हमारे पास एंगल बन जाएगा ठीक है ये कर्व शेप में आपको एरो के साथ भी नजर आ रहा है इंक्लूडेड एंगल मींस कि यहां पे एंगल बन रहा है एंगल इज द अमाउंट ऑफ टर्निंग अबाउट द पॉइंट इन इस पॉइंट से आप जितना भी इन स्ट्रेट लाइंस को टर्न करेंगे जितना भी यहाँ पे आप जो टर्न करोगे उसी हिसाब से आपको यहाँ पे एंगल भी मिलेगा। For this topic I have a video for you. This video is very helpful for for you for this topic. Uh, so let's angles. Angles are all around us. Angles are formed when two lines meet. If there are two straight lines such that they have a common end point then the amount of turn curl between these two lines is known as angle between those lines there are angles in most shapes and in many of the objects you see and use on a daily basis angles are measured in degrees there are four types of angles. Acute angle, obtuse angle, right angle, straight angle. Let's find out more about these different types of angles. Acute angle. When two straight lines make an angle with each other such that it is greater than zero degrees, and less than 90 degrees, then these lines are said to be making an acute angle with each other. Some triangles have acute angles. Here are a few examples. The slice of pizza that you eat for lunch is an acute angle. You get a new box of pencils to take to school. After you sharpen all of the pencils, you notice that the tips are acute angles. Obtuse angle. When two straight lines make an angle with each other, such that it is greater than 90 degrees and less than 180 degrees, then these lines are said to be making an obtuse angle with each other. Many shapes such as pentagons, octagons, and triangles have obtuse angles. Let's see what makes an obtuse angle. You are walking by the water and you see a beautiful sailboat you notice that the sails have obtuse angles. You are playing outside with friends when you look up and notice that the top of your house is an obtuse angle. Right angle. When two straight lines are perpendicular to each other or make 90 degrees with each other, then they are said to be at right angles. Right angles are often shown with a box in the corner. That lets you know that it is exactly 90 degrees. Squares and rectangles are formed using right angles. Let's look at a few examples. You are looking out the window of your house. You notice that the window panes are formed by right angles.
you are exploring a new city with your family. You notice that many of the buildings are built out of brick. The bricks all form right angles. Straight angle. When two line segments point exactly in the opposite direction and form a single straight line, then the angle they form is 180 degrees, or straight angle. Okay, after this video, I hope you can do easily your worksheets. Uh, but some recap. Uh, what are angles? When two straight lines meet at point, an angle is formed. An angle is the amount of turning about the point. What are the types of angles? Uh, we have different types of angles. Acute angle, obtuse angle, right angle, straight angle and reflex angle. Okay, thank you so much for watching.